about 30 seconds. Buzzing. Dramatic sign up. We are done. We are signed up. Kiss it. It's been an interesting year with the old man cutting the hair, giving me the old skin fades. And I'll tell you what, I've seen people leave the barbers with way worse hair than what my old man managed to give me. He is a professional barber, after all. We actually made it to Lad Bible just over a year ago today. I think it was a year and two days ago as of the day that I'm filming this. Um, or three days ago. And anyway, not important. We made it to Lad Bible and the, the, the comments were interesting. What is our haircut experience? You say zero. Well, I have a haircut pretty much every week and like every guy, I have my favorite barbers. I even travel 40 miles each time so that they can actually be the ones to cut my hair. Ted's Barbers Nottingham. Recently, I've had them every week until now. Obviously, if you're watching this and it's in the future, well, it's 2020 right now and is it the fan and everything is closed. People were convinced that because he did that good of a job and we had like a, a proper thing alongside the 15 pound Argos trimmer, that he was a professional barber. He was not, he never has been, never will be. My dad fits kitchens, bedrooms, bathrooms, things like that, you know, he's really good at it. Cutting hair, that was his first time. <laughs> Sorry, lad Bible. So we started watching a ton of skin fade videos and they were actually really good, really helpful, millions of views and these haircuts actually look sick, but they're all using clippers and razors and stuff that's worth hundreds of pounds and we're trying to emulate the same result with a 15 pound trimmer from Argos. But today, in a roundabout 18 minutes, 17 minutes and 34 seconds, I will be having my mop cut. I've never had this long in my life. I've always wanted a little bit longer. I didn't mean this long, right? I can literally kiss it. I've never had that in my life, just literally being able to go. Can't say I've ever desired to have that either, but you know. It is time to finally get a pro skin fade, get a good inch off of this, I reckon. Today's gonna be a video of first. We're gonna go to a new barber's, we're gonna get a gym membership. Oh my god. <laughs> I have that much faith in this new barber's that I'm not even bringing a hat and I'm going to the gym straight after. So I might be nipping back for a hat if it's crap. But I have faith, I'm excited. I'm not gonna be bringing my camera in because I don't wanna be that weirdo that just rocks up. Like, who is this guy bringing a massive camera into my friggin' barber shop? But here is the before, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> Looking fabulous. And after. Here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. We look like a normal human being again. We have a fringe that does not touch my lips. It barely touches my eyebrows. And that is probably a little bit shorter than I was going for, actually, to be fair. However, sick fade. Look at my fade. I just feel like a completely new man. The old man, you know, you did good. You did good, but it's nothing quite like the barber experience going to a proper place to get your hair done, you know? I just like the experience and it was a good place to go so I will definitely be going back again. But now the time is around about 11 o'clock. We are done and we are going to head to town to sign up for the gym.
good. The finger we use on this one on the one behind the other day. Awesome. I'll see you soon, mate. Cheers. Tell you what, I used to work in a gym, right? And the sign up was never, ever that simple. I just spent about 30 seconds doing a fingerprint, give my name, email address, and that's about it. But ladies and gentlemen, it is that simple. You can catch me here, down at UFB, on a daily. We are done. We are signed up. Buzzing. I'm so, I'm so excited. It's really difficult to explain, right? But for someone who loves the gym as much as me, actually has the gym technically as his career, right? Technically speaking. For someone to have got to this stage that of doing what I'm doing right now and not have had a gym membership, I don't know if there's anyone else in the world that will have had that, right? I'm home, I'm a home gym boy. This godlike physique has been built from a home gym. So I reckon it's time to get friggin' massive down at UFB on a daily basis. Well, five times a week, of course, because I'm following my five day plan, you know. Sai, you're a legend, mate. I've got so much respect, so much time for Sai, and hopefully you guys can come down and see just what a genuinely nice bloke that he is in person. Look, I know this is gonna sound a bit daft to some people. I, I, I understand that, right? But leaving the home gym for me and leaving home just in general, you know, um, was a big, big deal for me. And um, although I'm still going there here and there, I'm still working with the old man and you know, I still get to see my family and I still get to train in the home gym, see the pup, all that kind of stuff. Um, it was a big, a big deal for me to move, you know? Um, and so feel, being made to feel so welcome in a place like this, you know, it, I can't, I, I honestly cannot express how much it means to me to just walk through the doors and be welcomed with open arms and a smile on people's faces. You know, it, it, it really does mean the world to me. So Sai, I appreciate you, my friend. Thank you so much for everything you've done for me so far. And I know that we are just getting started and we've got so much cool stuff planned in the future. So Sai and everyone at UFB, thank you for, for welcoming me into your family. I am... Um, I appreciate it. It means the, it genuinely means the world because, like I say, when when we move back in January, obviously gyms will close. I know, and I realise that that was the same for everyone across the country. But I just it was it was a massive, massive deal to me to to leave the home gym and to leave home just in general, um, and so to feel welcome um, at a gym like this is it. I know I'm just repeating myself. <laughs> it's. It's awesome. It's it's really really nice. So, Sai and everyone at UFB, I appreciate you, and let's get massive. I've got to admit though, I was hoping for a bit more of a dramatic sign up for the video. It was literally like two minutes. It was all sorted. Anyway, back home, get some grub, see the missus, and on with the day. So I figured out why it was a lot simpler, right? Why the sign up process is um, a lot quicker and easier um, at Ultimate Fitness than anywhere else. Uh, and it's because there's no contracts, right? And if you go back about two minutes in the video, you can actually see a sign that says no contracts, right? Whereas if you go to a, a more commercial kind of gym like what I used to work at, they tend to lure you in with contracts, 12 month contract, six month contract, and that's why it takes a lot longer. So, if you don't wanna be lured into a contract and you want a gym membership, and you're in the Birmingham area, highly recommend getting yourself down to UFB. Plenty of content will be coming there over the next few weeks, uh, media content and personal content. To be honest, I can't remember the last time I did a session and didn't film it, so, my camera will be with me there every single day. I'll be known as the weirdo with the camera, and I am perfectly, Perfectly okay with that. I'm really, uh, I'm really buzzing to just make some progress down there and uh, see how we get on. I, I think it could be really good for me, um, training-wise. You know, because obviously I am home gym accustomed, if you like. Um, all of my training has ever been in a home gym, and so having all these machines at my disposal, having just the sheer volume of, of, of stuff that I can potentially do in a gym that is as well kitted out as UFB is just. I think it's going to be 
really, really good for me. Um, don't get me wrong, I love training in the home gym, always have done, always will do, and I still get that kind of excited feeling when I walk through the door, and that sounds stupid, we've had the home gym for like six years, but I walk in there and I'm like, yes, this is sick, you know, and I'll still be training there as often as I possibly can, whenever I'm working with the old man, I'll probably go back and hit a session there as well. I'm just having a place like Ultimate Fitness that I can report to on a daily basis to film some really cool videos for you guys. I think it's gonna be really, really cool for the channel, really cool for, for me and, you know, for the gains. So that's that. Thank you to Sai. Thank you to everyone at Ultimate Fitness. You guys know who you are. I appreciate every single one of you. And if you have made it to this point in the video and you have not already, drop it a like, drop it a comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Thank you all so much. I appreciate every single one of you. And I will see you in the next one. We've got some cool stuff coming. Really, really cool stuff. We've got Ryan Terry on the channel, training with subscribers. Oh, it's going to be a good week. I'll see you then.